Hello guys, welcome to a new video about Mancharo, the latest beta of the 18.0. Oh. So first we will start a new installer. So this is the latest Git version of the installer. So when we click on next, we have uh, the map and the keyboard loud, as you know us already. We simply erase the disk, enter our username and the passwords. And for this demo, we will automatically log in and use the same password for the administrator. So if you see here the summary, you can click on install now. So it has a question to actually ask you. So since we don't do that now, we will cancel it here and close the welcome widget. So what do we have? Well, here we have the Withcom menu and you see here all the categories if you click on all you see what software packages we have already pre-installed in this uh, edition so we see here gimp we had there we have the libreoffice and if you scroll down further you will see also our, our microsoft office online packaging if you want to use the microsoft products and of course a lot of settings if you go now into settings, we have here uh, the standard settings menu, as you know it from the XFC. But also we have our tools, like here we have the PAMAC. PAMAC is our graphical installer. If you look here, we have here um, the database a refresh. You can simply put in your passport. If it's wrong, it will say authentication failure. And if you put it right, it will automatically update uh, the database files. And here you see, these are the packages. But what we can do now is also we can automatically download the updates and even uh, hide the try icon if we don't have any updates available. So the official repositories, now it's a standard worldwide, but we can choose the language, for example, Germany, click on refresh the mirror list and we'll do a refresh again. If you have uh, additional packages you don't find in our binary repositories, you can always enable the Arch user repository and even check for updates there. And if you want to delete the caches, you can do that as well. So let's search for VCL. You can simply click here and write or simply write already. So this is the binaries. And here we have the additional packages if you have the IUR enabled. What else do we have in settings? Well, additionally to the XFC, we have also the Manchero settings manager. The one of the coolest features is the kernel. So we have here the models. You can see here we have a lot of kernels you can choose from. In this edition, we have installed the 4.16. But if you want to know what changed for the 4.14, you can see here the change logs in rich detail, what uh, features this kernel version had before, and you can simply read through them. And again, we have also the appearance. It's a little bit different than uh, if you know it from the GT2 version. So this is GTK3 version. So the upcoming uh, XFC 4.14. So we have here also the icons you can choose from and change the fonts if you want or even change settings. What a cool feature is there as well is the composing of the window manager. So you can click here on the window manager tweaks. You see here the cycling, the focus, the accessibility, the workplaces, the placement and the compositor. So you can simply enable or disable. So if you disable it, you have no shadows or whatsoever. And uh, you can see here transparency. You can always choose how far you want to have it for each settings. So yes, and one of the coolest feature is the audio mixer. So you can use here the pulse audio, whatever you want to use for. Have the configuration, you can simply the input devices, the output devices and the recording playback settings. And what is also really, really cool, if you click on properties, you have here, you can enable and even select some media players. So what is the feature of some media players? If you look here, there's nothing there. You have only the mic and uh, the, the phone. 
you click on multimedia and for example choose a VCL you can see here now you have a widget to actually control if you play music or videos to do the next track so that's for it the changes in the batch 3 of the 18 releases